Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 5. In the last part we uh, we set out exploring the uh, the seas and uh, took out another one of the wizards on a boat. And in this part we're going to keep going around, wandering around the seas with Markal, mainly Markal. We're going to be attempting to get up to Lawkeep up here. It's going to be tricky to get to. Actually, no, no, it, it really isn't. But it doesn't matter because uh, we're going to do it anyway. But first, we're going to attempt to fight some water elementals because this this sounds like a good idea to me. Now, split up the stacks best we can because these guys have. These guys have Circle of Winter, which is dangerous and painful. So we've got to move forward as quick as we can, split up, split the stacks as best we can, so that uh, Circle of Winter won't hit everybody. Uh, yeah, I was expecting that. I was expecting that. Mm -hmm. My vampires should be able to... Uh, to heal off most of the damage. Skeleton archers, however, they they can't. So uh, we're just going to have to spam heal on them, I think. Uh, shoot, to wear them down. Mages are great. No. Uh, move away. I kind of want to give uh, give some kills to the vampires so that they can they can get some of their health back. Mm -hmm. To be honest, apparently I can get another uh, another turn, so it doesn't really matter. Cut. What are you going to do? Ice bolt or circle of winter? Well, screw you two. Uh. Nope, not taking that. That's not something that I think I can actually deal with. So uh, let's let's try that again, shall we? Like properly. Yeah, splitting the stacks up as best we can is the uh, is the way that you need to deal with this because well, if you don't, then you're getting all three, uh, then two or three stacks are going to get hit hard like that. You see? But how come my vampires didn't get a chance? Oh, not my uh, my. Oh yeah, it's because I moved my zombies before, didn't I? Or something like that. Uh, I hate you guys. I really do. I hate these things. It's so annoying. We'll just wear them down as best we can. We're not going to kill them off because that would be a bad idea. We'll move the zombies closer. We're going to get rid of as much as many as we can without actually getting kills with, without finishing off the stack because if we do that then any magic they send at us will be not as effective mm -hmm. uh, I don't really care about the zombies at the moment Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Out of range, really? Well, if you want to do that, then that, that's fine, I guess. You need to come closer. Do, 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 do. 
Don't get the kill yet. I'm gonna raise my uh, skeletons back. I'm much more worried about the skeleton archers than these plague zombies because there are only there were originally only 18 of them. Oh, whoops. Sorry, I just knocked something over there. Yeah, there were there were originally only 18 of them. 18 is not a good enough number to for me to care about them at all. In fact, probably they're probably going to be the stack I get rid of quickest if I get get a choice. Um, sorcery, expert sorcery. I don't really care about getting expert sorcery. I've got the two feats from sorcery that I really care about, which is of course arcane training and mana regeneration. I'll pick up our advanced leadership. Although that's only because um, sorry, that's only because I want to pick up. Uh, Herald of the Dead. I mean, I already have uh, diplomacy, so. Yay! Artifact. It's actually pretty good. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do that, because that's a good idea. I don't need two more defense. I don't feel threatened enough to, to need that. Just grab all the resources. Seeing as no one else is out here, might as well. You know. and then head back to the boat, because yay. <laughs> yeah, well, that, that that first fight could have gone a could have gone a, a bit better, but hey, what you gonna do? Oh yeah, I need to upgrade you. Yay. Um, we could upgrade the archers at last. That's probably a good idea, to be honest. Moxman. Now we can stack these archers, archer and marksman squad stacks. There we go. Godric's going to be the guard, as always. You can head over there and yeah, just stay there. Sleep and sleep. Hooray. Godric's going to be coming over as well, but after I've gotten one more week. One more week's worth of troops. Actually, have I got all the troops this week yet? I don't think I have. No. Marksman. Oh, I still need more ore if I want to grab the garrison. Darn it. Oh well. I get the training grounds. That's probably a good idea, actually. Let's get the training grounds and take advantage of it. I think this is probably the first time I've ever shown this off. The training grounds allows you to train lower level troops into high level troops. Such as these conscripts. With the normal training grounds, you can only upgrade seven troops at a time, or one troop seven times. So basically, it's just it's just seven uh, upgrades. Basically, you get seven upgrades um, if you build the upgrade for the the uh, training grounds, the Hall of Heroes. You get twenty per week. And the cost of the training is, is cut as well. So, there we are. That's pretty much uh, all the troops I'm going to need. Actually, no, no. We'll uh, we'll wait for another week. Into the boat. One more week. Well, this week's worth of troops. Yeah, this week's troops, and then. Uh, and then Godric can come out as well. All the heroes. I don't really want to bother with that right now. It's not worth it. To, not worth it for another five of my ore. Ore is expensive, you know. Expensive and fairly rare. Oh my god! Everything's so expensive. Jesus. <laughs> Do I need all of that crystal? Yes. Paladins. That's what I need all the crystal for. So, what have you got, wizard? Mm, a fair amount. I'm actually kind of intimidated by that, if I'm honest. So, I'm going to chase down this wizard instead. Because <laughs> this wizard doesn't have anything at all, basically. We. Yeah, this is the one with hardly any armory at all. Although, how they managed to kill off that many troops, I don't know. <laughs> 
Oh, I see. It's because they were clumped up. I don't care about the zombies. The vampires can come over here. And the s normal skeletons can too. <laughs> Just block the entrances. My big stacks need to block the entrances. This guy is a, a, a specialist in fire magic, if I remember correctly. Which I think I do. Mm -hmm. So fireballs. Fireballs all over, I imagine. Yep, there's the fireball. That hurts. There goes my plague zombie stack. All of them. <laughs> uh, I'm more intimidated by those 20 golems than the pathetic number of... Uh... Can any stack be hit by a fireball? Can any two stacks be hit by a fireball in this formation? No. That's good. Because it means that... Does this heal me? No, of course not. I'm not surprised. It means that I can focus on reviving my skeleton archers right now. And hopefully, we can get this kill. Yes! Only lost three, three plague zombies, and now I've freed up a stack as well. <laughs> that was an easy win. Easy and practically free win right there. And now I'm going to run away from this wizard up here, because he actually has a moderately threatening army, and of course he is a wizard, so he does have, like, dangerous magic. I'm gonna head over to the west, and see what's over here. Probably not a huge amount, but hey, if there's anything, then it's worth looking up. Mm. We're basically at the edge of the map now, so not really any point in uh, looking around there. I have a lot of wood, which is good. I still need more ore, though, and more gold. For, but mainly, mainly ore. I'm just going to finish recruiting everything. You know what? No, you you can keep conscripts as well, because I don't care about them. I'd much rather split my uh, stacks of inquisitors so that they can cast spells. They can cast more spells. <laughs> I still need more gold though, so I can upgrade my uh, cavalier building. But hey. Mm -hmm. Just finished recruiting the calves. Hooray. And I can upgrade to squires or g imperial griffins. I'm thinking imperial griffins because griffins are good. But I can't afford to. Yeah, I'm not surprised by that. It's an awful deal. There's no point in uh, in worrying about that. I'm going to be heading out with Godric because Godric has a good-sized army now, and this wizard army over here, wherever that one went shouldn't be too much of a threat anymore. Hopefully. Over here, here, there's nothing there. That's fine. Nothing over here, nothing over here. No. There's a water route over here. <laughs> I'll take that. I'll take a water route that I've never seen before in my life. <laughs> so, your danger is low for Godric, because Godric is really good. He's a very powerful hero and also has a very large army. Hitherto undiscovered route. I well, know I haven't discovered it before. I can't actually land yet, but hey. what you gonna do? <laughs> I'm actually not gonna start uh, recruiting things uh, aside from the peasants. I'm gonna recruit the peasants, and that's it for now. Cause I'm saving up gold to build buildings as opposed to recruiting troops. Mm -hmm. Grab that sea chest for gold. 1500 gold is good. Flotsam, that's going to be good. It's wood and gold. There's some more flotsam over here. For more gold. Wood. And there's some more here. Godric can head over here further. Whee! 
I mean, if the if the wizard's going to run away, then that's fine, I guess. Oh yeah, I need to do stuff, don't I? I need to do stuff in the week, don't I? Whoops. Crystal. More wood. That's nice. I've got 40 wood now without even trying. To. It's kind of crazy, to be honest. And there's 45. More gold over here. We 10 more wood. I have 55 wood. I don't need any of it. <laughs> well, I can afford my uh, paladins now. That's nice. Woohoo, paladins. Again, not not recruiting any troops right now because because I have other things to to deal with. It's not because I'm lazy or don't have. Ah, oh, empty sea chest. What? What's this? Well, that's disappointing. Oh well. Another empty sea chest. Well, screw you too. Screw you too, game. Jeez. Well, that one had nothing either. What the hell? So butthurt because I've got no troops. Well, no, no money from those chests. Chests are supposed to be full of loot. Come on. I don't care about that building at all right now. It's not bothering. I'm not bothered by it at all. Is that the wizard right there? I think it was. I think that this route was a complete waste of time. Hooray. I should have sent a backup here. Oh well. Hmm. Uh, which, which route would be the best way for Markal to enter? Probably this route, so that there's there's a load of uh, undead stacks over here that you can pick up for free. So let's bring him back. Godric can find nothing again. Heaven's sake. <laughs> At least that thing, that one had something. Sheesh. More peasants. A lot of peasants, actually. Some gold. And up here is going to be some priests. Hooray. Now, now that I have ten ore. Oh no, I need f I need twenty ore. What? What? Well, I can upgrade the footmen to squires. I don't really care about that, to be honest. At least, certainly not right now. I'm gonna sa I'm gonna keep saving up for. Um, I'm gonna keep saving up for uh, for the archangels. Hmm. Okay, Godric needs to go over here and take this guy out as quick as he can. Because <laughs> Markal's coming back. Why are you actually faster than Godric? Oh wait, I, g I gave him uh, logistics, didn't I? I guess that uh, also governs sea movement, I suppose? I don't know, I didn't give him navigation, and that's a certain. Never would. It's a horrible idea. It's a horrible, horrible idea. <laughs> okay, so 34,000 gold. Is that enough to recruit everything? <laughs> Probably not. We can try. Mm -hmm. no, I don't care about you. Just go away. Be off with you. Um, only just. Only just enough. Actually, one week's worth of, uh... Ah. One week's worth of uh, of money would actually be, I think, exactly enough. Plus whatever buildings I actually built this week. But... Well, not exactly enough, but pretty much exactly enough. Right. You're getting annoying now. Come on. You could demon. Oh, no. Right. I'm, I don't feel very threatened by you, so I'm going to fight you. A lot of losses. We can take him. We can take them. Um, now, angels over here. Marksman. I need to rearrange my uh, my stack now that now that everything's all uh, everything's all messed up. I guess. Uh, 
marksman there. These guys there. That's good. The angels can block this route. The cats can block that route. And the griffins can battle dive. Or no, no, they can't. I completely forgot about that. But hey. Yeah, the calves can block roots fairly easily, to be honest. Um, that's some titans. That's quite dangerous, but we can deal. We are going to need to split stacks a bit, though. Let's see. Can we haste anyone faster? No. Then let's use endurance. It's going to be a fireball right here, I can tell already. No, cast it on the marksman. Damn it. Endurance on the marksman. Zap. Yeah, as soon as those arch ar archmages pop up, it's going to be a fireball right on there. I can tell already. We... So... Can we haste the... Uh, can we haste the marksman fast enough to get past the, uh, the archmages? Almost certainly not. Okay then. We'll wear you down as best we can. Shing. It was 92, 82 damage? Or 92 damage. That's painful. Glad my angels have like a load of HP. <laughs> Otherwise, they would be they would actually have been, been hurt by that. Let's just wait. The, uh, the griffins. Fireball. I'm predicting a fireball. Yep, there's the fireball. Ow. That hurt a lot. Ah, oh, jerk. Do you not have any spells left? What's going on here? Let's see. It could raise dead, lol. It doesn't work. It's not, not, uh, not powerful enough. Benediction, Puppet Master, Curse of the Netherworld. No. Um, mass Haste? Why not? Mass Haste! Yay. Mm -hmm. So I actually lost an angel in this fight. That's awful. It really is. Mm -hmm. um, on the mages or the titans? Let's, let's focus the titans. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I'm. I'm. That makes me sad. Oh. Well. Stab. There goes most of that. That uh, riffraff there. <laughs> now my angels can come over here and cut this guy in half. There we are. That's nice and easy. Only I actually realised how powerful the first eight tech could be, and had you know actually picked up uh, war machines. But I didn't. Because <laughs> I'm a derp. Mass suffering. Your attack goes down. Blah. There's only two stacks left. Just take out this Titan. Then. The angels are fit pretty good health. Hopefully, they should be able to take a. Uh, there, yeah, they're fine. They're fine. They're fine. Bonk. Mm -hmm. That was easy. I mean, I lost an angel and a few uh, other other things. I think the AI actually did better with that one, but I haven't got any resurrection ability yet. I haven't got archangels yet, so I can't really guardian angel. Yes. So I can't really uh, take any advantage of it. What's Godric's level now? 14, which is basically 34. Seeing as the last uh, level cap was like... Seeing as the last level cap of... Hi. Huge, huge army. How's it going? 
That is a, a genuinely threatening army right there. But hey. Yeah, I, I lost some troops. That's how it goes sometimes. I wish it didn't, but sometimes it does. And peasants. Upgrade the archers. Give them over. There we go. Now you can head back to this, to the windmill. I'm just waiting for archangels right now. Just archangels. That's all. Windmill, more resources. We. Uh, Markal can come back as quick as he can. And ooh, experience, uh, estates or resourcefulness. Uh, well, I'd rather not get estates, but resourcefulness is even worse <laughs> for Godric because he kind of needs a. Is it? Is it really? It really isn't that bad. It's better than estates, for heaven's sake. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Yay. Yeah, we got, uh... Yeah, we've already got the main skill and uh, luck that I really care about, which is soldier's luck. As opposed to, um, the main skill and leadership that I really want, which is, uh, divine guidance. Yeah, I already missed out on uh, on power of speed, not power of speed, um, on whatever that skill was that increases your move, your uh, troops movement. I don't remember the name of it. Damn it! Oh well. Deal with it. It doesn't really matter, but I don't remember it. It's just it's that skill that's under leadership that increases movement. Archangels! Yay. Now I have resurrection power. Hooray. <laughs> now I actually have a sustainable army. So after Godric's gone around and uh, picked up all the resources around here, he's going to come back and upgrade his army with everything that, uh, that he needs. You need to move faster. Like, like a lot faster. Archers money, then peasants, then priests, then back to the city. Money, peasants, priests, next turn. Go Godric. Grab those chests. Grab those chests. That isn't a euphemism at all. We... You need to... Is he still there? No. Oh, that was a, that was sirens. What the hell? No, not doing that. It's an awful deal. I thought it was like a guy on the log, the guy on the log thing. You know? Apparently not. Oh well. Oh well. Let's do some trading for all. Seeing as I don't need this much wood, ever. I will never ever need this much wood ever again. And there's me squires. Hooray. Mm -hmm. Archangels are exper expensive. They're powerful, but they are expensive as well. Mm -hmm. um. More sirens? Really? Why are there so many sirens in this map? What the hell's going on here? Uh, priests. Hooray. Now back to the city for you. And then back to the windmill. Hey. Uh, can't afford mage guilds. Let's just go with the troop recruitment. Again, it's, it's expensive, but we need, we need it. We need it. We need the troop recruitment, because that's basically the entire point of us having a city. 
is so that we can get troops out of it. You know? It's kind of the point of this entire endeavor. More troops, more peasants, yay. I have 19 gold left. Wow. We Now, let's get... Let's get us a proper city. A city that fits with our... Uh, with our faction. 167 skeleton archers, I'm taking that. Or like, uh, probably like 120, 130 now. But still. There's 20 ghosts in here? I'm taking that, that's good. That's good, that. Now, should we go for these liches and then these ghosts? Or, should we go around here, pick up these ghosts, and then the sh shadow dra spectral dragons? I'm tempted by those, actually. And then these liches up here and the zombies up there. Let's do that, actually, that's a good idea. Actually, I kind of want to, kind of want to clear this uh, this hill fort. Yeah, I want to cl clear the hill fort so that I can finally st stack the uh, those whites, whites with the the ra whites with the raids. So I haven't got two stacks of of uh, of two diff uh, uh, both unupgraded and upgraded le level sixes. I don't mind having multiple stacks of level sixes. I just wish that they weren't, that they could be stacked if I wanted them to, so that I can have other other armies in my and other other stacks in my army. So let's do that next part because 32 minutes. I'll see you guys next time when we finally get to capture Lawkeep up in the top left corner up here, up here. Finally, going to get back to get get to capture Lawkeep, which is it's guarded by a very small amount of, uh, of forces, and uh, then we'll clear out this island, get as much experience as possible, and then we'll fight it, fight this guy, these guys, eventually. But I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody.